It's said that when the blood moon rises, a young soul will be cursed with black magic. No one knows the origin of the magic or why the blood moon could cause such a thing. All we have gathered is that a poor soul will be tragically bound to a destructive entity known as the Corrupt. Not many live past the age of 18 due to the high bounties for corrupted souls. Some never make it out of what we call the changing. When someone undergoes the change of being soulbound, the life must fight to stay alive. When the blood moon sets, the change is complete and from then on out, the young soul is bound forever. The corrupt entity hides within its life host, almost as if it's a parasite. Corrupt souls come out when the body and mind show extreme emotions of anger or when felt to be in danger. Many bees can live with being bound if tamed, but the process is a long one. Many don't live long enough to master the skill. But somewhere out there, there's a corrupted soul who is willing to fight for their life. I can almost feel it. Wherever you are, don't give up. Are you sure nothing I say could change your mind? I'm sorry, Gianna. I can't stay. But, but why not? You know why, G. I, I could protect you. I... Gia, I'm doing this to protect you. But Octavia, it's... Gianna, you have to let me do this. Do what? I don't even know where you're going. I'm just going to a small village outside of Melanoa. There was talk of a healer there. I just... I have to see if something can be done. What if there isn't? I can't lose you, too. You won't. When I find a cure, I'll come home. I promise. Please don't go. If I don't, and I lose control and hurt you, or worse... I trust you. I know, but I don't trust the capabilities of my nature right now. Promise me, Tavy. Promise me you'll come home soon. Give me three months. I promise to write you when I can. Okay. Don't worry too much, Diana. I'll be home before you know it. I know. <clears throat> I, uh, put some bread in your bag. And some water. Oh, thank you, G. I'll be home soon. I swear it. Be on good behavior now, Vinny. Well, there's not too many folks around here. Um, I excuse me? Huh? Hello? I'm sorry to interrupt you, but do you have anything to eat? Where... where are your parents? I live with my aunt, but she's gone foraging and it's been Halloween. I see. Here. Have you had anything to drink? Ma'am, I haven't gone to the wall yet this morning. Here, drink up then. It's too warm out here for you not to be drinking water. Um, now that I've helped you, could you help me? I was told you have a healer who is a witch. Is that true? Oh, you must be talking about Lorraine? Yes, uh, where can I find her? What do you want from Lorraine? <gasps> God, some morning would have been nice. Go home, Carolyn. But... Athena should be home. She's been looking for you. You. Who are you? I'm Octavia. I'm just seeking help from the healer. What for? I don't have to tell you that. You do. Why? If you are a threat to Elizmere, I will have you banished. I'm not a threat. Whoa, okay. Settle down, Makai. Go back to your post. Gosh, what an ass. Don't mind him. He's always like that. <sighs> Welcome to Elismere. How can I help? I'm looking for the witch, Lorraine. In that case, you can find her straight ahead, in the building afar. I appreciate it. 
I'm Octavia, by the way. It's nice to meet you. The name, Philip. Thank you for your kindness. No need. I hope you find what you're looking for. You! Are you insane? Huh? Do you know how dangerous it is for someone like you to be here? You know? Of course I know! Well, I... Uh, I'm not done speaking. Not only is it utterly stupid for you to come here, it's reckless and... Okay, let me stop you right there. Excuse me? Not to be rude, but I am not here on ill intentions. I'm just here to fix my problem. Fix your problem? You're corrupted! There is no fixing! That's what they all say, but I don't believe that. Are you kidding me? You don't- Lorianne, guess what? Not now, Esther. Uh, who is this? I'm- It's not important. She's corrupted. Well, this is great! What? I've been reading old medical and science journals on corrupted souls. I've been dying to experiment- Th Did she just say experiment? <sighs> yes. Yes, she did. Um... No, no! Listen! I have a theory about the blood moon and the changing ritual. I just have to know if my theory is correct. Esther, please, let's not do this. Life is short, Lorianne, and I intend to live mine to the fullest with science. You can help me, or... Heaven's fine, enough. If you show any signs of turning, so help me, I'll kill you myself. I, I understand. Uh, this is so cool. I've never met anyone like you before. What's it like? Tell me in detail. I... She's probably out of control like the rest of them, Esther. Actually, I don't think so. Elaborate. I haven't had any urges. At least, I don't think so. Well, that could be because you're freshly changed. How long has it been since your ritual? Three months. What? Amazing! That's incredible! It's unheard of. Even better! Has it really been that long? It has. Is that odd? Newborn stage is a frenzy where the newly corrupted soul entity hunts, meaning they slaughter everything in sight to gain more control over its host. I guess I don't know enough about this. How... How did it happen? I was alone one night in the outskirts of my home, and then I saw this shadow-like figure approach me, and... It stepped into me, I guess you could put it that way. I could hear its thoughts, its feelings. It was like... Anything I'd ever heard of about corrupted souls. Lorianne? I think you are the cure. What? 